There's concern over food recalls here in Maine due to listeria contamination. Last month, Hannaford recalled several kinds of store brand frozen waffles. A dozen and a dozen prepared meals sold at Shaw's were recalled for potential listeria contamination. News Center Maine's Katie Delaney breaks down what you can do if you buy an item that gets recalled. If you buy food that's been recalled for listeria contamination, what can you do? Let's start with how you can find out when a product has been recalled. The U.S. Food and Drug Administration posts recalls on their website. Some grocery stores like Hannaford post all of their recalls online as well. In a statement, a representative for Hannaford says, we work closely with our suppliers and regulatory partners to monitor these issues and will continue to assess any additional actions that may be needed. Once a recall happens, stores remove the contaminated items from their shelves. Co-owner of Edwards Brothers Supermarkets, Jeremy Edwards, says they take recalls seriously. The public re relies on us as, as retailers to, uh, you know, not only provide, you know, affordable products, but quality products and safety is, is very important. If you've purchased an item that's been recalled, you should discard it or return the item. Most grocery stores offer a full refund. If you've already eaten an item that might be contaminated with listeria, then it, you would just want to pay attention to symptoms. Um, they're pretty generic symptoms, fever, nausea, diarrhea, headache. If you start to experience those symptoms, you would want to call your provider. Sarah Robinson with the Maine CDC says recalls are mostly a precautionary measure as listeria infections are uncommon with an average of less than 10 cases a year in Maine. There is no reason to panic because of these recalls. For immunocompromised people, pregnant women and newborns, Robinson says a listeria infection can result in hospitalization and sometimes death. So it's not to be taken lightly if you have it, but it again, it is a rare condition. To help prevent all foodborne illnesses, the Maine CDC recommends washing your hands before cooking and eating, cooking foods to the proper temperature, and avoiding cross-contamination. In Bangor, Katie Delaney, News Center, Maine.